So I'm going to create two lists. X equals Yumi and Yun Yun. And that's X. Y equals Vic and Yuri. So X and Y. Now I want to take X and append. Hmm, not append. I want to extend X with Y. Notice what happens now. X and I get Umi, Union, Vic, and Carry. Now what the system did was it went and took all the individual elements of Y and it affixed them to the end of X. All well and good. Watch what happens when I use a different command. X dot append Y. Now what, watch what happens to the end of X. Now we have Yumi, Union, Vic, Carry just like before, but now look what has been appended to the end. The entire list object Y. It's been appended as a list, as a single unit. It's now in here. Well, hmm, can I remove it? Well, <clears throat> watch. You can key in X dot remove and then open parens, and you can remove Yumi. And now if I can't X, Yumi is gone. Let's put Yumi back. Insert into position 1, Yumi into position 0, uh -huh. Yumi. And there we go. She's back. Now, I want to get rid of Vic and Gary, the list. So I'm going to try and use the remove command. I'm going to be in big trouble because it expects character data, a value. Uh, it expects, uh, not a value, it expects character data, like Yumi, Union, Vic, Gary. I'm going to say 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. <coughs> Four. Element four. And it's going to give me an error message. <coughs> Excuse me. It does not like that at all. So how do I get rid of it? With the pop command. Pop element four off of this list. Zero, one, two, three, four. And it should now be gone. And it is. Huh. So what did we see so far? <coughs> we saw we looked at the extend command versus the append command. And so the differences in how Python adds data, affixes data onto the end of a list. We also looked at uh, pop versus remove and how these two expect different inputs within the parentheses. And that's about it for now. This is George Bull. Bye-bye now.